Okay. But you had that one friend who was so fucking cringe, who is still cringe to this day. And see, you say anything to oh, him. <laughs> Whoa. He is so cringe and he was your b- And you never told him that he's not smart and not interesting. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Just Saying. We still got the same crew uh, on the couch with us today. Yeah. Yes. Please say hello. 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 We never left. That's hello. why we are still here. Right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We've been here for weeks. I guess you guys like it here. La. It's a very uh, nice couch. There's everything we need. There's like, something. Yeah. Very comfortable. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Happy Thank you very much. And you got me my oatmeal latte. And that's what, what about the show? Do you like the show? <laughs> oh, of course. Yeah. I like, okay, I like okay. the questions. I was just telling you. <laughs> right. Great questions. On this. <laughs> <laughs> Let's start the episode with this. Uh, what's the worst thing you've ever done to a friend What's I'm a fucked thing? up friend Last yeah. time yeah, okay, Last time okay. Oh my lord This is as fucked up As it is bro right. He is So we were very young I think I was 15 <laughs> Okay okay Because when, when you say very young I was picturing 6 Oh no 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 no. <laughs> I was I was, uh, I was like 15, 16 bro okay. When uh, skinny jeans Was still a thing mm. Not even skinny jeans Like tapered jeans You know mm. You had to put the plastic To wear your your jeans? Yes. Yeah, and I was that kind of chop. Okay, then I might. Uh, you know, uh, Sydney Leisure is here. And then there's a traffic light here. Yeah. Mm. And then there's a house there. Okay. Whose who's house is that? I have no idea. Oh, okay. <laughs> right? And then yeah. behind that house, there used to be this like uh, haunted house thing. Okay. That everybody would go. I mean, it's an abandoned place where everybody oh. would go and spray shit. Okay. So we were there and then we started like, I mean, just exploring the place. Lah. Right? So there am I. And then the neighbours who uh, was there, the, the house there, uh, started shouting at us like, yo, stop doing that, this and that. And then we were like, fuck, but it's abandoned, this and that. Right? So then we, when we were going to exit the place, we will go past their house. Mm-hmm. Okay. So I'm like, ah, fuck these people, right? So I went to open the electrical box and I basically just turned off everything. <laughs> I turned off. Oh my God. Because the electrical box was outside there. So I turned out everything and I, I pulled out some wires. Now, of course, the whole house shut down, right? You can't do that. So then the whole family oh came out. Oh my God. And then the whole family came out and then it started chasing us. So we all ran. We all both fucking from Sini Leisure. I ran all the way to Dobi God. Oh my God, okay. <laughs> but I got caught because my jeans were too tight. That's why I t- <laughs> the skinny jeans. <laughs> That's why I made it a point to tell you what jeans I was wearing. Okay. So okay. my jeans was so tight, right? I couldn't run properly. And then my, my jeans started tearing, lah, right? And then I got caught. Lah. And then this big guy, he just hung me. And I got caught. And then we, they were like, what do you want to do now? They like, they say, I'm going to bring you back to my house. And then we're going to call the cops. They brought me back. And then I was young, right? Uh, and then the, <laughs> and then so I, my friends, <laughs> okay, my sorry, my friends managed to escape. This guy okay. catch me and my friends managed to escape. Mm. So then I'm like, no, I'm gonna, not going to be caught alone. Mm. So I called my friends. <laughs> On the phone <laughs> to come back. <laughs> oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> Worse, right? I thought so. They came back. Uh-huh. Fucking steady brothers, right? Yeah. And then the cops came. Yeah. And then I'm like, guys, I really cannot go to jail. Mm. Like, cause my parents are not here and everything, and I don't want my brother to find out. Yeah. And I was so scared that I really, literally begged my friend to take the case for me. Right. Oh. And he did. Wow. wow. Who's this friend? He's he's. Oh, okay. We are not friends. Still, yeah. still friends to this day. <laughs> no. Oh, wow, yeah. he, he took sure it for you though. Yeah, so so okay, but in the end nothing happened. Okay, like okay, okay. the 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 father was like, ah, they're just young kids. They don't know what they're doing. Let them go. But mm-hmm. my friend was like, was telling the police, sir, sir, it's me, it's me, it's me. No, it's me, it's me, it's me. But she was me, and they right. did nothing. No, they were just there laughing while I was right. doing it. That was the worst thing I did to a friend. Right. And if something happened, he would have taken it from me. But I don't know what would happen. I guess the most is like uh. I won't say ventilation, no. Uh, <laughs> ven- uh, like vandalize, right? Or oh, ven- vandalism. Uh, vandalism. Ventilation. Oh, <laughs> 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 yeah, you ven- unplug ven- that box. That's, yeah, that's, that's, a strange, that's, a- that's a strange thing to think. Like, oh, I'm going to like shut off their lights. Because it was the first thing I saw. I mean, I can't go uh, into their house and fuck them up. Was it the right? middle of the day? Uh, Yes. Wow. Yeah. So I like I, I mean I heard music in the house. Okay, so there so was music. music. So I applied the music. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh my god, what if they had like grandma on like a light? Oh, oh shit! Yeah. yeah. And then and then the grandma died and then I asked my friend to take it. And then yeah. he didn't know he's in for a murder case. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> Damn. Jay, worst thing you've done to a friend, Jay? I, uh, a friend uh, 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 something <laughs> the worst thing a friend has done to you. The worst thing a friend has done to me. Uh, is something like what happened to you is like friends who try to get you in trouble to cover their own ass. Mm. Mm. I don't think I was doing that. 
Okay, fine. Friends. I got into trouble. <laughs> okay, like people who get you into trouble, I hate that. Ah, okay. Like you cannot be my friend if you get me into trouble. Okay. So one of my friends, she just broke up with her boyfriend. Mm. And so she called my house, like she came, she called me mm. and I let her stay in my house for like three days, mm. which was very nice of me already because I had a son mm. and my son was like a baby. So I really... So this was recently lah. Like in- Last Three five years, years ago yeah, yeah. yeah last five years During COVID Just around COVID Wow She orders drugs To my house To <laughs> help her get over the pain <laughs> Jackie is shocked wow. To help her get over the pain Of this breakup But then like My parents My par- Sorry My parents were staying with me At that okay. time Okay So my father is the one Who received the delivery Of the drugs What drugs is this? And the drugs <laughs> were very large drugs what? Like it was like Boxes of drugs Because what she was doing was It wasn't illegal But it's called nitrous oxide uh, Neng Ah laughing gas Laughing uh, yeah, gas laughing So gas. she had all these Like little canisters Of like the drug mm. So so the drugs it's, Okay it's not like A drug drug But it's an inhaler Like it's illegal mm. Like it's illegal To snort it I guess And and it would It would come in this Big box from From <laughs> Yeah you buy the drugs From <laughs> Wait, Like the SKP Yeah yeah, they sell yeah, yeah. baking, baking goods, goods, right? Oh yeah, I guess nitrous <laughs> is for. No, I thought nitrous is for oh, your yeah, like, sports the, injury yeah. stuff. No, that's acetylchloride. That's EC. Oh, the right. stuff that you spray into a bag, then you like. <sighs> right. Yeah. Right? yeah. No, that no, you spray into like a cloth, bag. and then you bite, and then you inhale, right? No, you spray into a plastic bag. Actually, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Do yeah. Now now you know, why? I, <laughs> now you know. Ordered... So you saw her taking it, lah. Oh, uh, so I saw someone take it before. Uh, okay, <laughs> great. <laughs> when I, I was, was in Vietnam, people do it in the balloons, right? Ah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, those that's nitrous oxide. Right. When they like have that balloon, then they slowly inhale. But that's because they have this big canister. Right. But in Singapore, that big canister is obviously limited to like dentists and like mm. under like special circumstances. But why can you order it from? Because. It's also pressurized gas. They use it for um, as cartridges when they make like foam. Oh. So they they are in little like one dose little canisters, and you plug it into this bigger canister, and right. then you squeeze it. The air comes out, and then usually you would have cream, right. and then you make a latte. Right. But some people put the cream end in their mouth, and they get high. Right. And it lasts like thirty Suddenly seconds. Suddenly, you know how to use it so much. Right. Sampai until the barista all, you know ah. But that gets over. I used that to help work you, in a cafe. That helps you get over a breakup. Is that exactly? <laughs> <laughs> probably? I don't know, <laughs> guys. <laughs> gotta get on. This. Okay, and then wait. So she ordered how many cans? She ordered maybe Okay so they come in Sets of like 150 uh-huh. And each can is like A little thing right And it comes in a box like that So she ordered two boxes 300 yes. canisters wow. Of nitrous oxide And so my dad receives this giant He's like what's this And you're like Well you ordered it And then um, He asked me what's this uh, he asked her, "What you know? What is this thing uh, that you've ordered to my house? And she said, <laughs> yeah. I'm starting a bakery <laughs> Them. But she was high, right? Yeah. So she slurry a little uh. bakery, <laughs> and he knew exactly what it was. So he came to me. And he was like, "This is girl is not your friend anymore. Mm. Uh. Like she's out. Mm. Get her out of no, this house." Your dad trusts you that much to know that it's not you, lah. I mean, it's kind of obvious which you. one of us is on drugs. Right. Because oh. I, I speak like this and she's like, oh, I was starting a bakery. Mm. <laughs> so, I mean, it's obvious. At my house, you're starting a bakery. At my house, why don't you order at your own house? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, she got high for another day and then I kicked her out of the house. Whoa. I just let her get high. I was like, okay, you know what? You need this. You gave right. her 24 hours. <laughs> yeah, 24 hours. This is yeah. your 24 hour period to get as so high as you want. 300 canisters in 24 hours? I don't know how many canisters, okay. but <laughs> after that, I had to dispose of the canisters right. for her. Right. So I'm like, oh man, it was it was the worst thing ever because the canisters are heavy, right? Mm. Like you need like a, so I had to go and borrow like one of those push trolleys and then like load her drugs on. No, the it. other question is where do you throw it away? You have to get it professionally. Like there's a professional like dumpster and then I had to pay to get it Motherfucker wow. Because it's it, it, But it's like Very little like It's like $10 But you have to oh, pay To get it Yeah because I thought If like If it explodes mm. No Because it's, it's already pierced Oh okay, okay. Oh, okay She's already okay. snorted them Right 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 Just the cream left <laughs> no, There's no cream yeah. Just the gas How do you tell her To leave though Like, she, like she's high mm. You're like You gotta go And she's like I'm starting a bakery You gotta go <laughs> <laughs> But I'm starting My bakery Support though local. My bakery though <laughs> Jackie Yeah well, I, I had a similar story to you. Uh, one time, 
I was with my friends at um, Serangoon Gardens. Uh-huh. This is quite specific. Um, <laughs> at my secondary school, they used to, there was a, a group of guys that, they were my friends, that liked to uh, steal eggs from RK House. Why eggs? How the fuck do you steal oh, eggs? Because, because they give it out. Because <laughs> they, leave, they leave the eggs right by the side, inside yeah. the 7 Eleven. Why not the ghee? You I'm know they have that no. stack of ghee. Yeah, they do. Why that. the fuck you want to use the ghee for? You steal the What the fuck cook. they need the eggs for? <laughs> no, but eggs so much easier to cook. How old were you? But it's harder Secondary to steal. School, uh. You can't put it in your pocket. It'll break. What happens if it breaks? No, no, no. They steal the whole tray. They steal See? the whole tray of the eggs. Wow. That's they take okay. the tray and then they will go to the houses and then like just throw into people's windows. Damn. It's like a... <laughs> your bad friend. It's like a pastime. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> right? That's, that's what... No, wait. Is. So, Sergio Gardens, they're all the... the, the, yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, and then one time, uh. somebody threw the egg into the house. Can and then grandma. We, no, then, we, then somebody say, what the fuck? Like, we heard it. <laughs> <laughs> then I, I went home straight away after that. <laughs> oh so these God. people are not your friends anymore, right? Uh, I mean, after in school, we would still say hi, la, but I guess yeah, they, they wouldn't invite me out to hang out with them as much. No, but it's not your fault that you chew into on someone's head, right? Mm. No, Wait, it, yeah. Isn't that, isn't that the whole point of chewing the egg? Yes. Um, <laughs> so then why were they angry at you? As in they, they weren't angry with me We just heard someone say What the fuck And then I panicked yeah. And then I ran away la. No he but ran away But he's not the thrower Yeah, yeah right? but, but, but the cops came And got them oh. like, like the guy The guy called police And then like the cops got them And then they had to go back To the police station To make a statement Oh yeah. okay 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 So that's yeah. why they were angry With you oh, like, yeah. why are they, oh, they were like You bailed Yeah because yeah. cause, cause I have street bus home from there So I <laughs> <laughs> Convenient. <laughs> so you went to a bus stop with eggs, ah? Uh. I no, I mean I, the eggs weren't with me. Like they were holding the thing, right? Like we just take, like someone's holding a the tray, then uh. we just throw, throw, throw. Not uh. we, right? Them, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, I was just there. <laughs> 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 but this was a long time ago, so we, we call ourselves the SGG, uh. the Stragoon Gardens Gang. Oh, oh, wow. <laughs> Hey, and we he hang doesn't out. fit what the fuck you're doing, ah. Maybe we... you take Vita with the eggs, and then you're fucking <laughs> egg gangster, you're like, Swagoon Garden <laughs> Gang. No and fuck. we hang out opposite no. of Cold Storage last time, you know, like, like where the fucking, I think Anytime Fitness is now. Yeah, it used yeah. to be a Cold Storage. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Right, so then there were there are benches there. Mm. So that's the spot we used to sit and hang out. SGG. And that's OCS, opposite Cold Storage. <laughs> mm. Damn. Uh, yeah. You know what's funny? Like my druggy friend, she was also part of the SGG, SGG, but not SGG. Right. They call themselves the gardeners. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Wait, sub- this is the difference if you're from a girl's school, bro. Right. <laughs> they were the gardeners. But I was from a boy's school. Maybe this. Yeah, <laughs> SGG right. sounds better. The gardeners, what the fuck? Then what no, do you do? The first time I heard you that, I said it. the <laughs> But okay, uh, next question. How do you tell if someone is a real friend or not? And uh, I, 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 I wrote down some... Um, common things that people will look out for, right? Mm-hmm. If this person is a good friend or not. Number one, communication. A good friend is willing to listen and talk to you openly about issues. Yeah. Agree? Of course. Yeah. yeah. Will you tell your friends that they suck? Uh, yeah. And what they want to do. Right? Oh, so there's, there's, there's levels say. to this shit, bro. Mm-hmm. So far, I thought about it, right? Mm-hmm. If let's say my friend wants to start a restaurant mm-hmm. and I know for a fact this fucker <laughs> cannot cook. Uh, right. <laughs> okay. But it's his passion, man. Mm-hmm. And he really thinks mm-hmm. he can cook. Yeah. yeah. Me as a friend, do I want to destroy that fucking dream for him? Mm. Or just let him have it? But I always start beating that cross line. I mean, I never experienced it, right? So I'm just like, would you tell your friend that this up? Dude is a liar. He will tell you that it's great. He won't say anything. <laughs> he won't say sh- He won't say sh- it shit. Depends, he won't say sh- it depends, though. It depends. Okay. When you started <laughs> DJing, I told you you were a sucky DJ. Yeah, but that's because, like, you know that I am fine to be told that. Mm. Like, you know that I'm fine with criticism. Okay. But you had that one friend who was so fucking cringe, who is still cringe to this day. I didn't see you say anything to him. <laughs> ah! Whoa. He is so cringe and he was your b- And you never told him that he's not smart and not interesting and he shouldn't start a podcast. You oh, never told ah! him. <laughs> Helps. <laughs> and look what he's doing now. Like, he please beat this out. But did you tell her she can't sing? Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> In fact, you didn't tell her shit. You did not. You never told her she couldn't sing. In fact, you like her videos. Wow. You like all her posts on Instagram of her dropping. I don't like her. I don't know. No, I just... And... (laughs) And and I won't, like... I got such a... (laughs) What? She can't sing at all. Those laugh... Like, there's... okay. She uploaded a video onto... And not one note was in key. Not one note in the whole song was in key. And... and Yo, kill her, man. And, and you know it, and yeah. I know it, and you still liked her video. Listen. 
<laughs> I'm embarrassed for you. <laughs> yeah, me too. Listen, when I said we have sh- okay, me and Jay have shared each other videos and we are asked questions. Where are their friends? Yeah, right. uh, yeah. Where are their like, friends? Where, uh, <laughs> because and, I will tell you this is nice, but I'll tell you it's not nice, and he'll be like, "This is lame, Jay. What are you doing?" Yeah, like where are your friends? Yeah, but y'all don't think that. Even if your friends suck, they could eventually become better. Like, have you seen that video of Ed Sheeran fucking busking? Ah, yeah, and yeah, he yeah. sucks, right? Like he's like he's trash, complete trash. And mm. he just it's really true sheer practice determination that he got as good as he is, right? But did he yeah. get there by his friends telling him like, hey, you can improve? Or did he get there by his friends saying, Oh man, you're great? Yeah, yeah that, that, I, that I cannot verify. But <laughs> like, like, okay, like let's say you are not funny. Well, you want mm. fast to tell you you're not funny? Who oh. Sure, but like, how do I put this? Like, as a comedian, you kind of have to know you're funny to be able to go and work. Like. If you don't think you're funny... Yeah. No, yeah, I so, think I'm funny. But I don't think I'm a funny as a stand-up comedian. Fair enough. Good. Yeah. yeah. But comedians will tell each other when we think each other's jokes are lame or hacky. And if you can defend it mm. in the court of backstage at a comedy show in the green room, then then you can keep using it, like, right? Mm. Yeah. Mm. Like So the feedback that you get is not always good, but it's... Like it's constructive. Yeah, I mean, we rip each other on jokes, and you, you, if you can defend it in that arena, then you get to keep doing it, lah, right? Mm. Like there are times where people say like, "Oh, what this is hack, that is hack," but I would say like, yeah, but you can't do it, right? Like things I do that you think is lame, sometimes you cannot pull that off on stage. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So mm. this is very different, lah, like, when it comes to funny, right? As opposed to hearing someone sing and then knowing that that sucks. <laughs> right? You look there, bro. <laughs> Even when you're the girlfriend, you never tell your boyfriend they cannot sing. <laughs> Will you tell your friend that they're fat? <laughs> yeah. Depends how you tell them. Yeah. Right? So what's the best way? I think I had this conversation with Faz before. Okay. I'm like, bro, if someone is fat, how the fuck do you tell them? Why do you have to tell them? As a friend, you went. Like, why do you... Yeah. But as in, why, why do you have to tell them? Like, do you just go up to your friends and you're just like, saying things that they're not happy with? Mm, they, that's, that's true, yeah. Like, I mean, no, maybe I, if she's I would say happy things that, that they're not aware of, lah. She's mm. not aware that she's fat. <laughs> Make, so, hey, listen, man. When I was fat, I didn't think I was fat. Okay. I, I know, I didn't think I was fat. Right. Yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah. But would me have come up to him and be like, hey, you fat fuck, would that have helped? That has helped, um, it, like, towards the end of my fat journey. Like, my fans just kept telling me, hey, you really fucking fat, bro. And I'm like, you know what? Maybe it's true. But were you happy? It depends. If I <laughs> like, I feel yeah. like if you're happy, I'm like oh, whatever. If you're happy, mm. I yeah, I, I mean it depends. I was happy, like I could eat whatever the fuck I want and not give a fuck, right? right. Versus now that I'm, I watch my diet a lot. But like, were you like having any health issues? I don't know. I didn't get checked, but mm. no, as in like, like but I couldn't tie my you... shoelace. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Fair. I couldn't tie my right. shoelace in peace mm. without oh. the tummy blocking my way, right. without panting. Yeah, you see, but so all of these things you already feel. Mm. And then when people tell you you're fat, you're like, fuck off, I already yeah. know, right? Like, so, like, to answer the question, like, I hate it when my relatives come to me and be like, oh, are you poor way? I like, I, I know. Well, like, you, mm. you don't need to tell me. So I don't think I would tell it to my friend unless he's someone that's like, hey, you gotta tell me if I'm mm. putting on weight or whatever. Like, the kind of, yeah. then, then sure, I'll let them know. But if, they, if it doesn't look like they are in pain, <laughs> Yeah. Then I think it's okay. I don't have to tell them that they're getting fat. For mm. me, it's okay. To be honest, it's the other way around. Like maybe sometimes because I see my close friend once a month, mm. so I realize I get a bit away. I'll be like, "Do you think I look fat now?" Mm. So you <laughs> ask them first. I'll ask them. So I want their honest feedback. Yeah. But I think most of my friends like treasure how I feel, so they always like, "No, no, I don't. I don't see anything different." <laughs> Even Actually, though that's I, a, that's <laughs> an intelligent way. But how do you know they're just saying that because you're really skinny? So it's like no, but if I mean, your there were times where I was like a bit, oh. like slightly. I can tell I gain weight lah, obviously. Mm. And to be honest, I would prefer if I were the one asking them, I would want them to be honest. Like okay, yeah, uh, maybe you did gain a bit. Then it will help me confirm my thoughts. You know, mm. then I can do something about it. You know? I think my friends for a long time will know that I always say this. Do you want me to be nice or do you want me to be honest? Mm. <laughs> and if you ask me to be honest, I will give you my honest thoughts. Mm. And they will not be nice. I once had my best friend. One time, I was like um, much heavier than I am now, and he was also my DJ manager. He brought out a scale in the office what the, mm. when I came. Oh my god! Yeah. And he's still one of my best friends, Daniel. Oh, you yeah, know Daniel? Okay, yeah. yeah, he brought out a scale in the office, and he said, "Step on that for me." Oh my god! Mm. And this is in front of the office, so I stepped on that. And he was like, "Do you think that this weight is acceptable?" And I looked down, and I was like, "Wow, 50 kilos, which is about..." 
seven or eight kilos more than I am now. Wait, Daniel is 50? I was 50. Oh, yeah. he was telling you that you're fat. Mm. Yes. Yeah, oh, yeah. Guy. Guy. Scale for me, bro. Oh. That's worse. And yeah, he's a that's guy terrible, also. Yeah. And, it, and, and, and so he's fat. Yeah, and, and he's, he's fat. fat. Yeah. So he brings he should out, step on the scale. Yeah. Wait, yeah. no. So he brings out the scale, he makes me step on it, and then he's like, you know, if you were just going to work in psychology, because at that time I was studying to get my degree mm. in psychology, if you're just going to be a psychologist, I wouldn't be saying this, but you want to be a DJ. Tell me who wants a fat DJ. Oh, oh what okay. the fuck? That's oh. fine. 50 kg <laughs> is not yeah, that. Yeah, 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 and and that me... was like my 13th reason. After that, I lost. 13th yeah. Yeah, yeah, 13th <laughs> reason. I lost like... <laughs> More than I lost like eight kilos. Wow! Listen, listen. Uh, it's not so much that people don't reason, want a fat bro. DJ, mm. but the type of DJ that you are. No, I don't think. Okay, the fat skinny aside, yeah. like let's not even go there. But it's like I really appreciated his honesty. Right. Mm. Because am I getting booked? Am I like earning now? Like yes. really a large a extent of honesty. He can just <laughs> yeah. he can just say. Yeah. But that was like saying, oh, he's your manager. Like, hey, presentation. Man, <laughs> I'm, I'm your manager and I feel like yeah. you don't look That's as fucking... good as you were oh, seven months ago. Oh, y'all don't even ago. know. There was this, like I had a, a nickname. You want to hear my nickname? What? Right. Sure. Fatty Jade. Wow, that's a DJ uh, name. I thought it would be more creative name. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's so mean. I thought it would be uh, Jade Fatty. F- and then he would send... <laughs> He, he started Fatsy. sending me photos that people were tagging me in on Facebook. What, what photos? Just photos that I thought I looked nice in. He'd be like, so bad. Wow. Wow. Yeah. That's, that's real manager shit, I guess. No, no, but then when I... <laughs> PR, PR. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, it was, it was bad, but... Yeah. Like it felt bad But then again He was like If you want me to stop And you want to not make You know If you want me to stop And you want to not make money Then continue mm. Like I can stop anytime mm. Just tell me If you want to make money or not I would You know what I, uh, I would tell my friends They are fat Actually yeah Your closest friends are Yeah Right, right. Yeah Yeah exactly Even if they're not close I'd be like fam <laughs> But what if it's a girl Will you do the same Yes Only guys Yes oh. No 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 Girls also I girls do the same I will say you look hotter last time <laughs> He will say that. Yeah. I've heard him say that. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like you need to lose weight lah. Okay. No, no, no. He won't say that last part. Oh. <laughs> like he'll only give you criticism if he knows that you will not be upset with it. I think a lot of people are like that. Yeah. Like, but I think that's part about being a friend, right? They they want to give you what is constructive, but mm. they also take into account your feelings. Mm. And like, sometimes there are some things that people can't change. Like, if you're a bad singer and your dream is to be a singer, it's not much you can change, you know? Yeah. Like... Sing better. Like, what is that gonna? <laughs> what is that gonna do? So, so sometimes in that sense, there's no constructive criticism. There's yeah. no being a friend there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, how do we make friends now? How do you make friends now? You just meet them. Just meet them. No, I think I think a lot of people are afraid of making new friends, mm-hmm. and it's very hard for a lot of people. First of all, they feel like insecure but another th- reason is because like I think we're afraid to admit to ourselves that we want friends mm. like it's very hard right as an adult to be mm. like hey I need more friends I'm, I'm lonely mm. because being lonely is so like frowned upon almost mm. so shamed mm. so it's very hard for people to admit that they want friends in the first place and so they don't go out there and get friends or they don't have the energy to yeah but like friendship. how do you go out and get friends you get what I mean you can because- come to my comedy show Jackie and Friends <laughs> On the 26th of October <laughs> And friends Yeah You can go and And that's where you get the friends Yeah so yeah. It, Like for example If I wanted to make more friends mm. I would go to his comedy show mm. And then like He would probably be like Make an introduction Between yeah. me and his The, the friends The part. friends that are performing And, and then like <laughs> We hang out in the green room after And you make like Three four new friends That's how you make friends Yeah 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 But how does Someone with not a lot of time Make friends And what but I think another way is like social groups. So like I made a lot of friends like outside of Singapore, like general friends online. Mm. Uh, through gaming. All right. Through gay what? You, like, you play like Dota. <laughs> what fucking <laughs> game you play? <laughs> LOL. No, <laughs> the New York Times crossword. I play every day. So sometimes. How do you what? You play online with them. Play crosswords with them. It's competitive. <laughs> it's highly competitive. Fucking loser. Yeah. <laughs> Karina, I, I thought you was gonna say like fucking Call of Duty or what? Cause yeah, that's what yeah, I thought like that's Dota. like what normal people you can't say. You make friends on Call of Duty. I play make friends Dude, online. I, I play Call of Duty by once. playing crossword puzzle. <laughs> that's right. 
<laughs> you making friends with people who retire already, or? Can I tell you something? I played Call of Duty before, mm. uh-huh. and I did not make friends. I made enemies. Okay? Yeah, <laughs> you don't make friends, you make enemies. Right. I learned swear words in so many different languages. <laughs> okay. They were called. They were so rude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were like fucking. Bo-bo. Yeah, dude, they were so mean to me. And I was like telling them, like, you know, I'm a mother. You can't speak to me in this way. It's very disrespectful. <laughs> so that's why you jump into crossword puzzles. Ah. Yeah. I was so abused. Was so abused. What the fuck, like, get, man? They were like, get good scrub. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Last question. What kind okay. of friends do we think we are? I think I'm, a, I think I'm an amazing friend. Oh, wow. <laughs> why? Well, I, I host that show, Jackie and Friends. <laughs> True. I give all of my friends... Technically, a, good time. A, a sport to perform at the show, and yeah, if if you're not performing, it's a, it's a good time in in uh, in the audience. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Jackie and friends. Yeah. I'm the type of friend who listens. I would say one negative thing about me is I'm very agreeable because I don't like confrontation or like conflict in any oh, sense. Oh, you're that kind, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Miss you're the fake one, ah. No, I'm not <laughs> fake. I just I just don't like to argue. Like for me, let's just find an easy way to resolve things. We don't need to like be upset at each other. Mm. Because I feel like friends are your like support system, right? So, yeah. for example, if I'm having problems with my family or maybe my partner, I would rather want to feel like I can confide in my close friends without mm. having the worry of having confrontation and conflict. But overall, I would say I'm a very caring person. I will be very generous also, kind. Hopefully, I mean, that's what I think. I think I'm the kind of friend that you need to accept doesn't reply all the time. Mm. Mm. Like, I'm like one of those friends. No, but you choose. You choose. No, I don't choose. You choose. Like sometimes I'm reading a book or playing crosswords, I won't reply you for like days, bro. Man, fuck your crosswords, ah. Uh. I love crosswords. <laughs> it takes days. I make so many friends <laughs> on crosswords. No, but like, you know something? We don't even play competitively. Hmm. Oh, how to play competitively? <laughs> Friendly yeah. time, time trial, uh, like no, you fa- finish faster. No, it's not even a competitive game. We yeah. just discuss the, the, the answers. All right. Oh. Fucking yeah. lames, ah. Uh. <laughs> But that's how you I make friends. I am embarrassed as your friend. That is how you make friends. Don't ever say I play online games. <laughs> Just say I play crosswords <laughs> and there are people. <laughs> I'm when a When you say you play online games, people are like, I it's expect yeah. fucking Call of Duty, yeah, Apex, yeah, Legends yeah, yeah. or Dota or some people shit. People on those games are so mean. You only make yeah. enemies on those games, bro. No, I made so many friends on Apex on Call, Legends. On Call of Duty. No, Apex Then why do you keep saying Call of Duty? Name one friend. <laughs> For every like nice I, comment you fair, get, I don't you play get Call 10 fuck your mothers. Mm. No, One that's friend. true. That's true. When I play Dota, also I'm like, oh, I'm going all off. Or yeah. even Mobile Legends, the worst. Oh. Uh, and Bobo, they, uh, Bobo Kao. Bobo Kao and like yeah. Una oh, yeah, 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 And yeah. I'm like, I am the mo. I'm the mother. Like, shut <laughs> the fuck up. Like, I'm not somebody's mom. You fucking cunts. This is the fun of it. No, it's I not. Guess. It's really aggressive. That's, but that's how some people actually have the fun when they play the game. Like, it's, it's not killing the. By like, it's, yeah. it's by triggering Cursing. people when by, you get upset. By triggering yeah. mothers yeah. on the internet. Yeah. yeah. But they don't know your mom, maybe. Yeah. I do. I always say, I'm, oh, like, I'm somebody's mom. <laughs> and kid. my son is going to be like you one day. And I'll be very ashamed if he grows up <laughs> like this. <laughs> and they... Okay, so <laughs> you know, what kind of friend you think you are? I really say I have, I'm like the mom. kind of friend that's like, like, I don't know. You tell me what kind of friend I am. I'm your friend. I will go to Jay if I need the truth, to be honest. Okay. Yeah. Um, right. Like real hard truth uh, that I will go back and cry, kind of, you know, like, fuck me. No, I always ask her for advice. Right. And I feel like that's our friendship also. She also, like, we always ask each, each other, other for, for advice. advice. And I think that's the great part of the friendship because we give each other, like, real advice. Okay. Uh, supportive. Dew is a supportive friend. Yeah. Like, but I'm a supportive friend. Like, if my friend, like, opens a business, if my friend is having, like, an event, if yeah. I'm in Singapore, I will always come and I always, like, spend money. Wow. Yeah. Do you see the report in the paper about this Singaporean actor and he opened, like, a Korean restaurant? It was yeah. in, like, eight days. Okay. And then... <laughs> he went broke. broke. Oh, of and you know what was the came. fucking headline, bro? What? I went broke because my friends come and don't spend money. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not it. Fam, yeah. like, I literally yeah. say her, I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah. Your friends will be so fucking embarrassed, right? Yeah. And like, no, and I, I'm also that kind of friend. If let's say someone open a business, even if it's like, not my friend, right? No, like recently, I went to a, a showroom and mm. he sees my friend's friend. Okay. And I literally, and I bought something and there was a defect in it and they were like, yo, let us refund you. And I'm like, no. Like refunding is the last option because I just want to support the brand. But yeah. this kind of support is so fucking important. Like mm. Jake comes to my gym and spend thousands of dollars for for, for thousands, 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 uh, thousands. Like thousands. Thousands. and then <laughs> there are other friends who come in for free. Oh, I know one guy. 
No, that one, that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the fat guy. Yeah, yeah the fat. Yeah, no, but that one, I yeah. gave it to yeah, him, lah, okay, because yeah. I mean he obviously needs help, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, he needs yeah. Help. yeah. No, but Jade is one of them that uh, Jade might be the only one. Hey, no, lah, like, other people pay membership, but Jade right. pays the most mm-hmm. in terms of PT. Mm-hmm. But and, same with you, like uh, we had a friend, and I was like, "Where are you going after this?" And he's like, "Some like I don't know, love bonito." Mm-hmm. And I was like, "What the fuck are you going to love bonito?" And he's like, "Oh, my friend is having a line with them. Oh, like okay. your friend had a." A collab or something with them And he went And he bought her merch oh. And I was like The fuck nah, Now you have like A useless top Like why would you do this <laughs> He has a female top Like he has right. a female top In the house He's like I don't know My friend opened the brand So I just bought And here you go Support is like There you know Like I mean um, There are levels to support So it's like Oh yeah good job Yeah you know what um, I'll, I'll be there for your launch But actually spending money On your, your friends Is another level of support Yeah yeah yeah, yeah One thing to Pay for their shit hmm. Um Even like simple things like sharing their stories, mm. yeah, yeah, and everything like, and I don't know why it's just this like Instagram ego where sometimes people don't want to share. So we've come to the end of this episode. Hope you guys liked it. If you guys do not know how to make friends, how do they make friends, Jade? Interest groups, crossword puzzles, no finding people with like common interests and like. Admitting that you need a friend mm. And then thinking about ways That you can make friends You know Whether it's re-establishing Old connections Or like Meeting new people And asking yourself How you can be a better friend And how you can show up For people So that you can receive That support In return wow. Yes If you have money Just spend on your friends It's okay mm. yeah. It means you're a good friend You want to support them money, Don't but... ask for free things Unless you really need f- Free things mm. You don't really need free things. Nobody actually need free things. You know what I mean? Or like you're selfish. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If they don't want to spend on you, you call the SGG. That's right. SGG. You're just taking this very personally. Yeah, and then you take the egg, you throw it in. Yes. <laughs> but don't call me. Uh, so I won't be there. Uh, yeah, if you guys have anything you'd like to talk about, let us know in the comment section below. If not, we'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye. Bye-bye.